I can't get him off my tail. High speed, high flying fighter jet dogfights and narrowly buzzing control towers. It's the stuff of high adrenaline action movies. Though for modern militaries, more like juvenile relics of the past. But Global News has learned that China is putting Royal Canadian Air Force crews in the danger zone with high risk, high aggression tactics in international airspace. The Chinese military is using what sources call dangerous maneuvers to intercept Canadian intelligence aircraft, currently on a UN mission to enforce sanctions against North Korea. Fast and agile Chinese fighter jets are buzzing Canada's slower Aurora aircraft with razor thin margins frequently zooming past the planes a mere 20 to 100 feet away, creating enough turbulence alone that Canadian planes could be thrown off course or risk a mid-air collision. It would be terrifying for them to do any kind of evasive maneuver because they might uh, trick the Chinese fighter pilot into doing something even more irresponsible and more dangerous. So the best they can do is fly along and hope that the Chinese fighter pilot doesn't make a mistake. The Chinese pilots are so close, multiple sources told Global News, the Canadians can make eye contact with them and see the Chinese pilots flipping them the middle finger. Senior military officials are concerned it risks the safety and even the lives of Canadian crews. And this isn't a case of a single pilot hot dogging. Sources say there have been approximately 60 intercepts since Christmas and nearly half of those have been dangerous. The Canadian government has sent multiple official diplomatic rebukes to China, calling the maneuver unsafe and unprofessional, all to no avail. The fact that the Chinese government is not responding to Canadian concerns seeking to rein this kind of adventurism in is also very concerning. One source told Global News pilots and commanders carefully assess the risk before each flight takes off, but there is growing concern that the new tactics signal a new tone from China.